tomorrow, Democrats in both houses of Congress are expected to introduce a piece of legislation, the sort of wonky sounding Employee Free Choice Act. The employees would get to decide what they wanted to do. They'd get to decide if they wanted to use the secret ballot election or if they wanted to allow employees to just sign cards instead. Cards saying whether or not they wanted to join. The Republican Party has come out against it. Take away the secret ballot election uh, from workers is not supported uh, by union workers, by potential union members. Actually, have you guys actually read the bill? Because if the employees still want the election thingy, they can still do that. Seriously. No, seriously, did you guys read the bill? This is Andrew Langer. I'm president of the Institute for Liberty. Well, I actually challenge you, Ms. Maddow. I want to know if you've actually read the bill, because I have. As someone who fights on a daily basis for small businesses all across America, I've read the Employee Free Choice Act, and I've got to tell you, you've completely misrepresented what it has to say. And you make the claim that actually the right to a secret ballot is, is guaranteed, but if you read Section 2 of the Act as it was introduced last year, it says the following. If the board, and that's the National Labor Relations Board, Ms. Maddow, if the board finds that a majority of employees in a unit appropriate for bargaining, if they've signed valid authorizations designating the individual labor organizations specified in a petition as their bargaining representative, then the board, that's the National Labor Relations Board, shall not direct an election. Shall not direct an election, which means no, there is no secret ballot election. So one of the things you don't touch on, Ms. Maddow, is the fact that there is incredible intimidation on the part of labor unions in terms of organizing these workplaces. Yeah. Hey, Ms. Mano, just take a look at, at some of these union organizers, like this guy, Sal Clemente. People just sign a card just to get you out of there. You know, they just, if they're feeling uncomfortable, they'll just sign that card just so you leave them alone. Just think about a guy like me showing up at your doorstep, talking to you about the union. You know, especially if I'm gonna present the card to you. Are you gonna turn me away and say, you know, oh, I don't wanna sign a card. I already know where you live. Ms. Mano, would you want Sal Clemente showing up at your door to talk about a union? I know that if he showed up at my door, I'd sign a card, and I have no interest in ever joining a union. So I challenge you, Ms. Maddow, correct the facts on your show. Read through the bill. Thank you very much.